welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video which I have for you guys a haul. I have a haul of things I've purchased and things that were sent to me. So let's get started with the things that I purchased because I'm pretty excited for all of them to start using them. Some I have used already because I'm a little behind on this haul. I'm going to start off with a few of the older things. I did purchase the Maybelline Superstay Concealer. I'm not sure if I showed it to you guys or I've used it. I think I've used it on camera already but you know it is part of this haul. This is what it looks like and that's the first thing. Then I purchased the Physicians Formula the Healthy Lip Velvet Finish uh, liquid lipstick. I don't remember if it was on here or on my Spanish channel that one of you guys recommended these liquid lipsticks so I bought the shade Berry Healthy. I still haven't really tried it out like good enough for me to know if I like it or not but you guys know this color it's like a berry mulberry shade that I mean I have like 20 of them but I keep buying that shade because it's just my favorite. And then I also got the Milani what is this called uh, Keep It Full Nourishing Lip Plumper in the shade Luminoso. This is absolutely stunning. It has become one of my favorites. Um, I really really like these. I want to get more shades. The shade Luminoso is like the perfect shade to start off with these or like to try it out. At least it was for me. So got that. Then I went to Marshalls, like always. I feel like I live at Marshalls. Um, and I found another liquid eyeshadow. This is a color Charmed. Um, let me show you guys. Obviously, I'm like trying to get it out of the box. Um, and it's those shadow mystery, mystery colors. This is the color Charmed. And this is what this one looks like. It's so cute. I definitely don't have this one in my collection. I know I told you guys in my uh, other video that I bought the same shade that I already had at home. This time I took a picture so that when I go and I look for more liquid eyeshadows, I don't buy the same one. Ugh, my tan is so ugly. Anyways, this one was $8.99 at Marshalls. Then I decided to go to Nordstrom Rack because I have seen these roll out there for a while now and I just have not had any luck finding them at Marshalls and TJ Maxx which by the way they are cheaper but you know I still save 10 bucks on each because the retail price for these is $20. It's the Lime Crime Liquid Eyeshadows. This is a box. It's the Diamond Dew Liquid Glitter Eyeshadow. This is what the box looks like and they are $9.97 at Nordstrom Rack. But again, I have seen them at Marshalls and TJ Maxx, like people posting about them, and I think they're like $5.99 there. So if you find them there, pick them up. If you can't find them, Nordstrom Rack has them, um, and you're still saving some money. I'd rather buy them for $10 than $20. And I got three shades, and I've been wanting these for the longest. Look at how cute these are. The packaging is amazing. I did not want to pay full price for them. And you guys know me. I just am not ordering from their website. If I buy anything Lime Crime, it definitely is going to be through Ulta. You know, I just don't want none of the old things to happen again. And you never know. Just be cautious. Don't order from their website. If you like their products, order from Ulta. <laughs> or a lot of their products seem to be rolling out at um, TJ Maxx and Marshalls as well. I got the color Luster, which is like a really pretty kind of like copper shade. Then we have Gold Dust, which is a beautiful gold. And then this one, which is absolutely stunning, Holy Shift. I love the name of that one. It's like a purpley blue. Absolutely stunning. So that's what I got from there. Then I placed an order for a new setting powder that came out from the brand Juno & Co. And you guys know they are the ones that carry the microfiber velvet sponges that I am absolutely obsessed with. I have the yellow, the purple, the lavender, the blue. I have like three blues, the cloud one. Um, when I or when I placed my order, they didn't have the pink one, but it's okay. I decided to order this um, powder, and they were having like a deal that if you bought the powder during their that weekend or the yeah I think the weekend that it launched, they were giving a free sponge. So this is a microfiber angled contour sponge, which you know I can never have too many sponges, and I'm obsessed that they included that. Um, the powder is actually super, super cute. It is like a rose gold cap and it's mirrored. This reminds me so much of the Huda Beauty setting powder. This powder retails for $28, so it's not like, excuse me. So it's not like super affordable, but it's definitely a little bit less 
expensive than the Huda Beauty. Um, even this little mesh detail reminds me of that powder. It doesn't have the little cap like the Huda Beauty one does, but um, man, <laughs> excuse me, it definitely still reminds me of it. And yeah, I'm still trying it out. This is a setting powder and it says it's brightening. It's a Juno Blur. It definitely ha does blur the skin, which is something that I have noticed. And I was like, hmm, girl, okay. Um, moving on, I went to Costco because they're finally, they finally had these on sale. It's open, uh, this one. I was on my last pack from my last box and I had ran out of both of the boxes. I like to have um, these on hand and I like to have backups because, you know, this is literally the only makeup remover wipe I use, the only makeup remover product that I use now because I ran out of like the liquid one. But yeah, I bought two boxes. This time around they did the packs. Oh, it's right here. <laughs> the four big packs and then the little individual ones. They did 20 of those. They usually do like uh, two of the little seven packs. They always change it up. Um, I like that the little individual ones come in this box. It's 20 of them in here um i always always buy these at costco now it's just so much more affordable they were on sale i usually always wait for the sale they're on sale for like a 11 dollars 67 or something like that so it comes with four of these and those 20 i bought two packs and then you know next time they're on sale i'll buy two packs again because i just can never be out of those so that's what i got at costco and then moving on i went to walmart to look for a lot of the things that i showed you guys in my anti-haul or yeah that i showed you guys that i did want to buy and i found finally the mirage palette by profusion i'm so freaking pumped for this palette i cannot wait i cannot wait to use it i want to use it already do a tutorial do a look this palette is just absolutely effing stunning i ugh, guys 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 i'm head over heels for this palette twelve dollars and 97 cents at walmart <sighs> obsessed then i also found the physician's formula rose all day highlighters i found the color petal glow or is it rose all day petal glow i think it's petal glow that's what it looks like uh guys i cannot wait to use this i just took it out of the box and i actually ripped the box um on accident but this is what the product actually looks like i wanted this gold shade i told you guys i wanted two but i wanted to start off start off with this color so this is how it would look in the packaging i just tore it up because i was too excited <laughs> and then i found the covergirl uh liquid glitter eyeshadow and this is in the color at first blush and it's like a taupey, like rosy shade. I'm super excited to try these. Someone told me that they are a really good dupe for the Stila ones. And you guys know Stila is my top favorite liquid eyeshadow. Um, but that doesn't mean that I won't look for a good affordable, affordable dupe for you guys. If you guys cannot find them at your Marshalls. And you still want something that gives that same look. Um, I'm going to test this out and see what the deal is on that. I feel like this is all CoverGirl. I also found the CoverGirl True, True Blend Super Stunner Hyper Glow. Ugh, that's a mouthful. And it's their new highlighters. I've purchased a palette from them and it was amazing. The highlighters literally impressed me like a lot. So I was definitely, definitely, when I saw these, I was like, I need all of them. I want to try this one first, see how it works, and then I'll go from there and get other shades. And then there's another product that now it seems to be lost. Oh, it's right here. Another CoverGirl product. I found the concealer. I told you guys I wanted to try this and I think a few of you requested a review. So I finally found it. I'm super super excited to try it i do want to get the setting powder as well so i can you know try a few things from the collection but these two are definitely from that same collection what else what else i think that's it from the things i purchased now let's move on to the things that were sent to me i did get uh two packages i think i showed you guys this i'm not sure if i showed you the package but trend beauty sent me a package i am on their pr list um and they launched this palette i have showed you guys this palette already they launched uh 8 15 2019 so last month can you focus camera thank you um this is an absolutely stunning palette if you guys remember my disaster video uh they included the cutest notebook says trend beauty and up here it says brilliant ideas i love all this like stationary stuff notebooks pens stickers you name it 
I love it. And let me actually get the palette right. <laughs> it's right here. It says Brilliant. That's the name of the palette. Uh, it's what's on my eyes today. Love it. I have been obsessed with this whole orange row. Like, it's my favorite row from here. And this, like, white cream shade with the yellow uh, eyeshadow. They're absolutely my favorites from this palette. And it's what I've been using, uh, or what I used a lot in the month of August. Because I was just so head over heels for this palette. So thank you so much, Creme Beauty, for such an amazing and super affordable palette. I think it's only, like, 12 or 13 50 Like, that's such a good price. And then we have a package from... Um, Focalier, they contacted me and they asked me if I wanted to try some of their makeup products because they like my videos that I do for you guys where I show you guys a lot of stuff that's affordable and you know I include a lot of um, aff affordable products and their brand is pretty affordable so they wanted me to choose some stuff and try it out if I like it share it with you guys and I had been eyeing their brand honestly because I saw their liquid eyeshadows and they really caught my attention I saw them on Instagram and I was like you know what I need to know what this brand is all about what they have and then I saw their palettes and I was like oh my gosh so I chose a palette and a few other goodies um first of all they uh I chose the sunrise palette and guys I know I know you guys are gonna tell me why would you choose that one if it's a dupe for a palette you already have but I mean you guys can tell me that this palette reminds you of a certain Huda Beauty palette because it definitely does remind me of it 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 looks like a dupe I will be trying it out testing it out and see how it works you know I want to do like a full full clear dedicated video trying all these products for the first time and give you guys my first impressions on camera because I feel like that's the best way you know to share with you guys a brand and then I also chose a highlighter this is a diamond glow highlighter in the color golden crystal and this packaging for these highlighters is so freaking cute it's like white acrylic or plastic packaging it says glow in rose gold the camera would focus and stop playing games there we go and then you open it and I really love the little like stamp they kind of have on there it's kind of like two shades but the peachy shade is like very small so I feel like it will mix well with the lighter shade and it would it will create a beautiful beautiful shade um the info is in the back I just really like the packaging and it's magnetic super super cute then they also sent me two liquid eyeshadows that I am so freaking excited for. Like, this is what really caught my attention from their brand when I saw it. Um, and I got two shades of, two of the most shades, two of the shades that caught my attention the most. Because um, honestly, I wanted them all. Look at the packaging on these. Like, that's what I cannot get over. The packaging of these eyeshadows. So cute. Look at that. So this first shade is Amethyst Crush, and it's kind of like a wine, purpley, gold, all together shade. So, so pretty. And then the other one is Peacock, number 12. It's a pretty gold shade with like a peachy iridescence to it. Obsessed. And they also sent me four liquid lipsticks. You guys know liquid lipstick lover over here i have picked four shades that are perfect to transition and to wear during fall winter <sighs> that's all i've been waiting for since summer started is for fall to be here i am so ready i'm not a pumpkin spice latte kind of girl but i'm just a fall 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 kind of girl so those are the four shades i chose you can see them right there really quick i will do a full video you know trying all these out and i'll do swatches of everything and all that jazz but that basically concludes this video I hope you guys enjoyed it I'm still a little bit all over the place with you know all the filming and, and uploading I'm upload here and there I'm trying to get better at it I promise I know I say this all the time but I'm trying to get back to a really good schedule um, like what I was doing it has been hot as balls here and sometimes that just it the heat drains all my energy um, I'm literally sweating I have a fan on me right now the AC is on and I still feel like I'm sweating because these lights are just intense um, 
but I have to push through it and I have to have content for you guys because I really enjoy making these videos for you guys and I miss you guys so much I feel like I always tell you guys that because I leave for like a week don't do it on purpose but anyways enough of that thank you guys for being patient with me and for hanging in there I appreciate all your support I am all caught up on the comments um thank you to all the ones who leave comments I appreciate you guys so so much um I love talking to you guys commenting and you know having a little chat in the comments so let me know in the comments down below what you want to see first the trying new makeup like all the new drugstore makeup stuff that I bought or trying out the Focalier brand I will be doing both videos just let me know which one you guys would like to see first and yeah thank you guys so so much for watching I appreciate all your support and like always I will see you all in my next video bye